Kevin Durant's journey in the NBA is truly something else. People widely acknowledge him as one of the greatest of all time, but he still craves the respect he thinks he deserves. According to Durant himself, he should be in the GOAT, greatest of all time, conversation. How's it going, folks? Today, I've got more updates from the Golden State Warriors, so hit that like button and click subscribe. During a candid interview with Dwayne Rankin of the Arizona Republic, Kevin Durant brought up the issue of his absence in the greatest of all time, GOAT, conversation. Durant boldly attributed this directly to his time with the Warriors, stating, because I went to the Warriors. Why shouldn't I be in that? That's the real question. Why not? What haven't I achieved? This impactful statement highlights the complexity of Durant's narrative, revealing how his decision to join the Warriors continues to influence the perception of his basketball legacy, sparking questions about deserved recognition and the criteria underlying the categorization of players as the greatest of all time. Durant's statement not only reflects a quest for respect but also prompts reflection on how career choices can shape the public perception of an athlete. By raising the question of why he's not in the GOAT conversation, Durant emphasizes the need to consider the context of his journey, inciting debates about the validity of criticisms based on his time with the Warriors. This controversy underscores the intersection between Durant's individual career and team dynamics, offering an intriguing insight into how the history of basketball is shaped not only by individual achievements but also by strategic decisions that mold these accomplishments. Now, let's take a look at Durant's stacked resume. He's got two NBA championships, two finals MVP awards, an NBA MVP, 13 All-Star selections, two All-Star MVPs, six All-NBA First Team nods, Rookie of the Year, and four-time NBA scoring champion. I mean, the guy's done almost everything, except winning the Defensive Player of the Year or securing a spot on the All-Defensive Team. But even with all these accolades, Durant's still not getting the respect he deserves, mostly thanks to his time with the Warriors. It's not just Durant, even Steph Curry catches flack for those super team years. If Curry had snagged those four rings without Durant, he'd easily be hailed as the GOAT point guard. The Warriors super team stint is like the elephant in the room for Durant, a conversation that'll keep tailing him until he finally nabs that sought-after ring without wearing the Warriors colors. And trust, that talk will cool down when that moment arrives. Did you vibe with the news? What's your take on Kevin Durant's journey and his place in the GOAT conversation? Is he not getting the props he deserves? Share your thoughts and join the conversation about Durant's lasting impact on the basketball scene.